What's up guys, it's Matt with Galaxy Games 843. We are back with another vending video. In today's video though, <laughs> you know guys, things are going to be a little bit different guys. So in this video, we came to service our soda vending machine here at the laundromat location. But as I walked up to the machine, I noticed the yellow or green lights are not flashing on the dollar bill acceptor. So right off the bat, I got to check some things out. And you can see there's no red light on the back there. Um, which usually means there's a problem with the coin mechanism or the, for whatever reason the coin mechanism is not activating that dollar bill acceptor So we're gonna start to run some tests We'll check our stock levels things seem pretty much the same So that means this thing has probably been down for a little bit for a little while at least So that's not a good thing to walk up to So not a way I wanted to start my day today, but you know it is what it is so We're gonna you know do some power cycles. We're gonna unplug and replug some connections We're gonna see if we can't get things working here while we're here so first of all we're going to unlock the power box so we can power cycle the machine and i struggle with the lock a little bit in opening up the power box uh if, you, if you've ever used these boxes you have to like kind of jiggle them just the right way to get them to open up properly and, and then to open up all the way you got to do it even more so <laughs> you can see me struggle there there we go we got that taken care of let's go ahead and power cycle the machine so i'm all i'm doing is unplugging it plugging it back in so everything power cycles and what I'm listening for is that dollar bill acceptor to start up and I did not hear it start up So that's not a good sign So guys, I'm not sure how long this machine has been down. We haven't been here in just over a week So we could have been losing money all week long because honestly nothing has really happened you know this this machine is not taking dollar bills and I'm wondering if it's taking coins So let's go ahead and do a quick check to see if it's taking coins. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna run some coins through it and see if it will vend now because we we haven't really had that many sales or the the inventory level is still pretty high i'm guessing it's not taking coins either because people use a lot of coins at this location so i'm just going to put some coins in and guys they're going they're, they're going right through to the coin return reject section so therefore i know that this machine is not making any money at this point so just to let you know what I'm gonna have to do, I'm gonna have to do some work on this coin mechanism to see if I can't get it working. So we're gonna run some tests here, we're gonna do some things to see if we can't get it working. Um, ultimately though, what we'll probably have to do is get a whole new coin mech. Um, but let's go ahead and take a look at the inside. So all you do is you just use these little fingers and you slide that down, you can actually start taking a look at things. I'm gonna unplug things, I'm gonna check things. And ultimately, you know, when you're, when you're on location, it can be challenging to you know do all the tests or troubleshooting you need to do sometimes you just need to get the, the coin mech back to the shop but ultimately guys you know i've had so many problems with this coin mech in this machine this is actually a replacement coin mech and ultimately i think i'm gonna have to get another replacement coin mech so here's another test i'm doing what i'm doing is i'm seeing if it will return coins when i press those buttons and since it's not returning any coins i'm pretty 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 sure that this coin mech is in fact dead and therefore is not going to work now off camera I did come back up to this location and did some more work and honestly I think the coin mech is 100% bad at this point so I did order a new coin mech and it is on the way it should be here hopefully today um, if not today tomorrow so we will definitely have a follow-up video later this week where we go back to the laundromat location and get this machine back online because right now guys it is not making any money for us and you know that's very unfortunate because you know it's a great location and it's getting the weather's getting hot and people are going to be thirsty at this location so i am feeling really bad that this machine is not up and running right now so hopefully we can get this taken care of today uh if not though tomorrow for sure so make sure you watch all the way to the end of the video guys and make sure you keep subscribing and keep staying with us so you can see what happens with this machine so guys, it, as you know, we're, do, we're trying to do a lot of content this week in celebration of auction week. So if you're not familiar with what the auction is, the auction is a coin off auction in Sevierville, Tennessee. It's this weekend, which is Saturday, April 17th. Uh, they're gonna have classic arcade games, pinball machines, jute boxes, claw machines, coin pushers, um, you name it guys. Anything that's coin op related, pool table, ski ball, dart machines, all that good stuff, guys, it's gonna be there. So if you like that kind of stuff, Again, subscribe to the channel. We're gonna do a live stream Saturday morning from the location. We're gonna do a preview video as well if you don't like live streams. And then Sunday, which is April the 18th, we're gonna have a full-blown auction video where we go over the coverage, where you see things actually get sold, you see what the prices are like. So guys, again, if you haven't done so yet, click that subscribe button, click that bell notification so you get notified when those new videos and those live streams go live. Um, while you're down there, guys, give us a thumbs up to like the video and don't forget to share our videos with your friends. 
All right, so I'm still doing tests. I'm still doing some. I'm still trying to get things working on the location here uh, with this coin mech, and guys, it's just frustrating the heck out of me. Um, I don't know how many times I could open this up and look at it and see if things are going to be different, but they're not going to be different. So again, I did order a new coin mech. Should be here hopefully today, which is Tuesday, April 13th. And if it's not here today, it should be here by tomorrow, which is Wednesday, April the 14th. So again, hopefully it's here today, so that way we can get this problem rectified today. Because every day that it's not working, again, we are losing money, and that drives me absolutely insane. So guys, put down in the comments if you've ever had this happen to you at your locations. If you've had a coin mech go bad and your machine been down while you've been waiting for replacement parts. You know, I thought about putting an out of order sign on the machine, but I did not do that. What I did instead was I covered up the coin um, slot with some duct tape. And you'll see that here uh, later in the video because I don't want people getting frustrated or trying to put money in and just going through and then, you know, them getting upset. There we go. Yeah, I'm just taking some pictures of the actual coin mech so that way I can um, make sure that I know the model number because I had to order a replacement, guys. So it is what it is. All right. Checking the DBA. There's a couple dollars in there. Not too many, but again, it's not going to accept any dollars while the coin mech is not working because the coin mech is actually what feeds or gives that, that power to the dollar bill acceptor. So a couple final checks. And I'm, I'm really frustrated at this point. Just, again, I don't know why I keep looking in there. <laughs> there is a little red light in there, though. That, so it is getting power. So I knew it wasn't that. Um, that was kind of the, the one thing I was checking. So I decided I'm going to do one more power cycle just to see if anything happens. Again, at this point, I'm just grasping at straws, just trying to see if anything will work. Um, but again, I don't expect much here. So let's do another, one more power cycle. There we go. Got that all locked up. Again, uh, the dollar bill acceptor didn't restart. Nothing is working. The coin mech is officially dead, guys. I'm calling it. The coin mech is no good. Um, so again, we're gonna go ahead and get this machine locked up. We're gonna block off that coin uh, slot, and then we're gonna go home and place the order for the coin mech, which you've already done, and it should be here today. So hopefully, guys, when you see the update to this video, you'll see us installing the new coin mech, getting the machine back online, and getting everything good to go. All right. <laughs> again there we go hey guys thanks for making it all the way to the end of the video again don't forget to subscribe to the channel we have just passed 1900 subscribers and we're working on that next milestone of 2000 subscribers so if you haven't done so yet click that subscribe button click that bell notification so you get notified when our new videos and our live streams go live while you're down there give us a thumbs up to like the video and don't forget to share our videos with your friends all right guys thanks for watching it's time to wrap this video up this is matt with galaxy games 843 we'll see you next time